is asking about istikhara. One of the greatest misconceptions uh, 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 among people, among Muslims, is that when they pray istikhara, they anticipate a dream or a sign from Allah Azza wa Jal. And this is not related to istikhara. Istikhara is to make your due diligence, to investigate, to start firmly thinking that this opinion, this option is the best of all other options. So you opt for it, you select it. Now I pray istikhara, two rak'ahs, I make the dua, Allahumma inni astakhiruka bi'ilmik, I seek your choice through your knowledge, and you say the dua. And you move on, you proceed. Now, if there is good in it for you, because you chose this and you went ahead with it after praying istikhara, Allah will facilitate it and will it happen. If, and if there's nothing good in it for you, Allah would make it difficult and you'll be turned off and you'll choose something else. So it is not a sign that you see or seek. It's not a dead cat that you find out your doorsteps or uh, a, a wedding that passes and makes everything happy for you and for your family. It is to go ahead with this marriage. If you did your due diligence, if you checked on the boy, he's righteous, he's practicing, his moral conduct is good, he has a good job, financially he's stable, his family is okay, you have a separate home of your own, you're not uh, to live with your in-laws, what more do you want? He's a good person, go ahead for it. What about this feeling that I'm having? What about this uh, 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 chest that I feel that it is getting tighter and tighter? This is from shaitan. This is from shaitan because this is a good proposal and you both will be or will do, uh, uh, become a good couple. But if there's something else that came up after istikhara, like the guy smokes or the guy um, is insincere or he flirts with women or he has rage fits or he's stingy. These are all part of the signs that may help you reject such a proposal and Allah Azza wa knows best.